So this is probably the closest I'm ever going to get to having a vlog. But I'm driving back from Menards and Walmart and shit. And I'm thinking to myself, what the fuck, man? When did everything just get so expensive? I mean, I got four fucking things. Four. Two of them came in a pad, one package. I got a little goddamn wooden spine set blessed because my old lady loves that shit. I love her. So, whatever. Go fuck yourself. But then I got, you know, this new phone holder because my other one I broke because I'm, you know, that guy. And, uh, the battery terminals for this piece of shit. Cost me 25 bucks. 25 bucks. For a set of battery terminals. Just the terminals. No cables. No nothing. A fucking Armor All motherfucking, uh, what you call it. Uh, phone holder that, you know, then y'all see my wonderful persona, personality. Motherfucker ain't worth this shit, though. Put a magnet on it. And, and just see, I got this. I got this for the old lady. Wait. Yeah, she loves her shit. And she is blessed. And I am blessed, too. Just by the sheer fact that she even fucking looks at me, let alone talks to me. Let alone but, uh, you know, it's just everything's so fucking expensive. I mean, she is like a minimalist, you know, and I am the absolute fucking opposite. I spend, spend, spend. I want this, and it's flashy, and I want this because it's bright, and I want this because it makes me look cool. And she don't give a fuck. Her favorite shit comes out of the fucking curbs, off the curb, out of the dumpsters. She got an eye for shit like you wouldn't believe. You wouldn't believe it if I... You just wouldn't believe it. It is, I don't know, fucking phenomenal, to say the least. She can see a piece of shit on the curb and fucking have this vision for it. It's, it's, it's something I don't understand. I mean, I get the vision once it's, you know, it's told to me. Yeah, I get what you're looking for. I can, you know, I can replicate, you know, duplicate or replicate, whatever. But I don't see it like she does, you know. And man, she's got an eye. But she don't, you know. She she makes all her own shit. Shit. She makes my charcoal for when I smoke meats. She makes my fucking charcoal. That's the kind of fucking girl she is. You want to talk about fucking amazing? not even gonna start on but no man you know and we're just like two totally different like culture fucking clash it's insane we uh you know I, I'm fucking well, I'm a little bit rock and roll and she's a little bit country and it's okay cause we're not brother and sister so when I fuck her I don't have to lie about it and then well I probably should lie about it though fuck me I don't even know where the fuck I'm at right now. Yeah, I don't know where I'm at. This out. I'm out in my old lady's territory. This ain't my stomping ground, so I have no fucking clue what roads go where, do what. What? They're doing all this fucking beltway shit, so there's all this construction. It's fucking insane. But whatever progress right so my old lady back to her is just total minimalist I mean she fucking repurposes shit that and makes it just into something that's either the most beautiful thing you ever seen or it serves a strong ass purpose and you wish you'd have fucking thought of it first she's that fucking good but she sees this shit man I don't know I don't I don't get it I mean, I know what I see, you know, and I'll buy it. But I can't make it like she can. I can't visualize it like that. It's fucking crazy. I don't know. I don't know 
what causes that, what gene that is, what gift, to say the least, that is. You know, it's just crazy. I, I mean, I absolutely have no understanding of the creativity that this woman has. And sure, she's been through hell. I mean, straight fucking hell, more than once. And she's got this fucking attitude and this, I don't know, this upbeat thing, man. You know, she just, I don't know, man. I, I don't get it. Because I'm pissed off. Everything. I'm pissed off about everything. Goddamn government. Fucking VA. Then go fuck yourself over there. And homeless bath. You know what I mean. I'm just mad. She just doesn't. It doesn't register with her. You know. She just doesn't let it phase her. She doesn't even know about it half time. She don't listen to the news. She don't watch TV. She's none of that shit. She loves music. Boy. She loves her fucking music. And uh. We don't always agree on it either, but whatever. But you know, I mean, I got this. You know, I'm not a, I'm not a Christian or a believer or whatever. I mean, you know, if there ain't some higher power, I mean, then, you know, what the fuck's the point? You know, or some next chapter. Or shit, what the fuck's the point? You know, whatever. So I buy this from old lady. I don't know which way it works, but. uh she likes this kind of stuff and like I said I absolutely adore her and she'll be upset that I spent $4.99 on that she'll think it's plenty but she'll love it don't get me wrong she's gonna she'll love it but she'll be like I can't believe you spent fucking money on me and it's like you know it's five bucks and to her five bucks is five thousand I mean if there's no difference money doesn't have a a significance to her at this stage in the game. She'll get by no matter what. She, uh, she she's learning to can right now. Yeah, learning to can. I'm all for it. Can of beer, can of whatever. You know. <coughs> but no, she she loves to learn. She's a very intelligent woman. To begin with. She loves to learn, and she's one of them that. Uh, well, she's a bit of a know-it-all. All right, she's a lot of a know-it-all. But when shown where she might be a little off kilter or, you know, I don't want to say incorrect because she's never incorrect, but she takes it well. She learns from it and then builds from it, you know. She's not a bitter person whatsoever. She has every right in the world to be. Every right absolutely hands down every fucking right in the world to be a mean bitter bitch man hating son of a bitch but she smiles and she fucking still sees the good in me of all people she fucking loves me I mean I've never had anybody love me like this in my life nor have I ever been in love like this in my life I've never had the butterflies never had the can't wait to fucking see uh, kind of shit, you know, that I, you hear about. I, I always thought it was a myth, but I get it with her. I get the butterflies, man. I thought I, I thought there was something wrong. I thought I had a virus or something. So I'm like, oh, what the fuck? Uh, here she comes. Oh, God, I thought I was maybe allergic to her. But no, yeah, you know, it's like <coughs> brand new to me. So it fucks it up for everybody, you know, because I ain't never experienced real shit. You know, all I know is phony fuckers. And, you know, so I see her, you know, doing what she does, and it's fucking purely genuine, and it's from the heart. It's all love, and she's just nothing but a giver. And I take it and fucking wrap it around a certain way and see if I can't turn it over once or twice and start a fucking fight over it, you know, because my brain you know, always got to be on defense, you know. And if you're not on defense, well, then you better start a fucking fight because you need to be ready. So, yeah. So, long story long, I've got this old lady that is the most amazing, absolutely beautiful inside and out, just person you want to be around, let alone, you know, the person that's in love with you. She's in love with me. It's fucking amazing. I mean, somebody like this, 
is in love with me. It, what? You know? It's just crazy. So, I don't know where I'm going with this. I'm just driving home. Do a little chatterbox. But I tell you, I do. I, I mean, I show her like I should. Uh, even though my little stupid ass signs. And little guy, I'm still a prick. You know, I'm, a, I'm an asshole. And I try not to be, but I got these triggers, man. And they fucking, you know, if, if I feel like you're going to attack me, I got to attack you ten times harder right away. Before you even get a chance to hit me once, I'm going to hit you ten times. I, I can't figure out how to shake that mentality. Because we'll, we'll be having a... You know, I mean, everybody argues. Everybody has conflict. There's always a fucking discussion. It's not a big fucking deal. But me, oh, hell. Once I feel like I'm being attacked, shit, look out. Here I come. Because I'm coming at you both fucking barrels. And Doc Holiday. So... And she's been putting up with me. I don't think it's going to last much longer if I don't get my shit together. Basically, how do I get my shit together? How do I fucking stop this goddamn thing from ruining the greatest fucking thing I ever, ever have a chance of fucking experiencing in my life? Greatest god... Chase, when I say GD. The greatest gosh darn thing that's ever graced my life hands down, no measure, no measure, she is absolutely the cherry on top, I mean, and the fact that she, the fact that she digs me, and how many times I've tried to fucking destroy this relationship, and she fucking grabs her tools and her trowel, and fucking bricks her back up, puts it back together, you know, and he's wearing on her, wearing on her heart, I can see it, you know, she's tired of having to do all this work while I'm fucking up, and, uh, yeah, so, I don't know, man, I need to figure out how to get a hold of myself, I'm not doing a very good job of it, and I need to be, There's a cop there uh, drinking and driving and shit. I didn't want to do anything foolish. So somebody can tell me how to get this fucking shit out of my head and act right. I need to get Chris Green to sell me a couple bottles of that act right he used to get. I don't know if we can still get it. I hope so. I'm gonna have to give him a call. So, but I'm almost home. I mean, to her house, which used to be home till I fucked that up. But I'll talk about that with you next time. All right. Well. Sorry y'all ain't me because I'm about to go be with the greatest gosh darn thing that's ever graced my life. Hands down without a doubt. Amazing. Amazing. Yeah, I'm that's, that's how fucking great it is. It's got me that retarded. All right, y'all. Until next time.